Good afternoon, campers. Much just on a little zoom out, so you know what this is about, don't you? So for those of you who are not aware of what's going on with Owen and George and the police car, it's been on the social media, uh, on their various platforms. At the moment, the car is jacked up because we're in the process of test fitting the big brake kit. We'll talk to you about that a bit later once we get involved with it and all that sort of stuff. But let's uh, take a look and see what's on the bench and then we can you'll have a better idea of what's going on here. This is a custom big brake kit of ours. If you've seen it before and you know all about us, I run it on my car, Phil's, Richard's, Robert's, um, Derek's. It's, you've seen it before for those of you who've been following the channel. Um, this is a little bit different because we've now, this is the first time I've done the, the big monster ones on the front in the yellow color, the same as what I originally put on my, on the Fiesta Little Beast. These are eight pop progressive piston calibers um, and they run four sets of pads. Now the pads are all identified, sheet there, look, which tells you where they go. These are 400 mil. So these are the same basically as what we run on mine and uh, Phil's um, because it's running, it'll be running Revo wheels the same as ours so that's already been done that's already in the system and been configured already so it's not um the rears of the custom ones so that's 400 by 34 so 400 mil is the circumference and that is the 34 mil for the thickness of it all right braided lines which are done for us by exact engineering as you can see there look, exact engineering all right they're local to us um so that's great this piece here which is the bell is the custom part so the disc is the same size then we can utilize and run the standard rear caliper so we've actually left as you can see that so that's as it's come from factory standard well it's not the standard wheel the standard wheel is a cast wheel so this is an upgraded forge wheel um he's got the different nuts on it which are better than the uh, standard ones that's got the standard caliper on it and all that sort of stuff so that gives you the the stance and the width and the offset and all that sort of stuff so let's uh move on to the next stage of uh, the police car. We thought we, before we put the wheels on, we've test fitted one side. Me and Mike done that uh, yesterday, just to make sure everything's all good, um, especially on the rears, because that's a new thing on the rear, so it was, we haven't done that before. But as you can see, so this is all on, 400 by 34, that handsome caliper there, which is like a monster size. You can't really appreciate it on video, Mike was saying yesterday, um, when you take a picture of it, it does look big, but you don't get the same sort of, well, the same idea. It's not the same, is it? Like when you look at it on a picture to look at it for real, it's like, yeah, that looks massive and it is huge. Um, so that's that done. We haven't put the braided line on yet because we've got to build the other side up. That's just on there as test fit. We've test fitted the Reva wheels onto it. All looks good. We've let the car down um, to make sure that the offset's good and the, uh, you know, the stance of the car is correct and all that sort of stuff. So the idea is, like I said before, we, put, we build the, one side up which we've done we leave the other side and then we can come show you what it looks like stock compared to um the upgrades and then we just go to the rear quickly and then we say so this is the the rear is all built up as well so this is a standard size disc this is a specific custom bell to suit front basically to go with the front so it all levels correctly and then owen and george will be here so yeah. So now the 400 mil disc is going on and obviously we're going to have a lot more stopping power. So Owen, with alloy wheels being such a popular upgrade for car enthusiasts, why have we gone from the RS wheels to these new Revo ones? Well, the ones that we got with the car, the optional forged alloys are a really nice wheel. Um, but aesthetically, I really like the Revo ones as well. And they also work with everything else that we're putting on the car to make it a really balanced uh, package. But I'll hand over to Martin and he'll tell you more about the technical stuff. Right, yes indeed viewers, um, so what Owen's got there look, is, like you said, it's the uh, Revo wheel, it's a flow formed uh, lightweight, it's quite a bit uh, lighter than the original as Owen's going to demonstrate now, um, it's also 8.5J as opposed to 8J on the original so it gives you that better stance, um, I just like them, I just think it's a great upgrade. I do notice that you've actually got the Revo wheels and some fancy tyres on your custom RS over there. Exactly, so that gave chance for yourselves and uh, Owen to see what the cars look like on the car, which I think is important, and with a big brake kit. And yes, that runs the optional Cut 2 tyres, which we can talk about a bit later on. That's awesome, isn't it? I mean, what's, what's the modern word? Sick. <laughs> <laughs> Looks sick. <laughs> I was not expecting that. <laughs> that's right. just lightly touching the back of the eyes. That's almost pulled a muscle in my neck. <laughs> 